morning guys and welcome back to my channel so today we are Sunday and it's morning it's 9 30 I guess somewhere and I'm planning on going to the Vogelgesmarkt with my friends which is basically just a market where we have something to eat something to drink and I don't know what else we can do you know I thought today would be fun to make like a little self-care video and I slept with my makeup on yesterday because I was so tired I fell asleep in the sofa and then I think around 11 I went to bed and I was so not into it so I just slept on with my makeup which is not such a good thing to do but anyways here we are I'm gonna do hair care first because I think it's really really important in October I colored my hair for the first time in like so many years and I used to buy just these regular kind of shampoos from the store however when I colored my hair I was like okay now I really have to protect it because it's probably damaged from the coloring and from the bleaching so and it needs to stop being so frizzy all the time and just in general look healthy so my hair can still grow I mean it's pretty long already but it still can grow a little more because I want it long 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 I want like up to here or something so then I've always heard that Olaplex is a pretty good product for your hair so I was like you know I'm gonna try this one so I'm gonna use Olaplex and with the coloring uh, my hairdresser also used some product from Olaplex so the hair isn't, isn't so damaged and doesn't fall out it was a pretty good opportunity to try the Olaplex wrench and if you can see it right over there in my shower right? today's Sunday so we're gonna do like an extensive hair care routine let the hair care begin. Oh, okay. We'll start off easy. So this is basically their shampoo, num Olaplex number four. It says repair, strengthens, and nourishes all hair types. This is their bond enhancer. And in the beginning, when I didn't know how to use this, I used this every other day together with the shampoo. So I would just mix them together and then I would use them both. It's not a good idea because I told my hairdresser um, how I should use the products and she said no girl don't use it every other day because it's gonna make your hair dull and not shiny and blah blah blah. blah. And I was like okay. She only told me to use it when your hair starts to get like greenish yellowish. Ever since I've been using it the correct way I guess. Moving on I have a conditioner. That's what it looks like number five and then a moisture mask what I do is I start by washing my hair with the shampoo and then I either choose the conditioner or the mask never both with the conditioner you can just put it all over I, I mean I take a decent amount and start from the roots and go all the way down to my ends however with the mask you just have to start like mid length somewhere and then just work your way down your ends oh someone's calling me hold on i'm back okay where was i yes so i think i explained like my little routine what i do and i have to say these products i'm really positively surprised because these are not cheap it's like um, luckily for me, my friend has some discount in the store, but normally this one goes for 30 euros, but I got it for 20 or something, so it's a good thing. I have to say, my like the hair frizziness, gone, completely gone, and it's just, my hair is also soft and it really it looks good, you know, it looks like healthy and my ends don't break. My hair used to fall out every time I would comb my hair, I would like take a bunch of hair out of it. I was like, how do I still have this many hair? But now, nothing. I mean, just like few hairs when I get out of the shower when it's wet, but it's normal, or just when I brush my hair, just like the normal fallout. I still have one more little step I use uh, just weekly works hair perfector number three and this one is more like a, a pre-mask like before you shower 
Hair care takes a long time, but the results are so good. Let's do it right now. We're gonna start with the little hair perfecter, and then we move on to the shampoo with the blonde enhancer, and then the conditioner or the mask. But I don't think I'm gonna use a conditioner because two days ago I used the mask already, so we're gonna do the conditioner. All right, so before I'm gonna shower, I'm just gonna take off the resonance of my makeup. I always use these ones from Nivea, cleaning wipes. Right now, I'm gonna move on to the, to the pre-mask. Okay, first step is getting my hair wet. So I'm just gonna let, let my hands first. Okay, so I'm gonna put a good amount, maybe like so. I have to get it like everywhere it says. So down the roots, in the hair. I think that's about right. So now we let it sit for 10 minutes. Maybe I should put on my timer. Okay, let's put on a timer for 10 minutes. Now, we can move on to skincare. I am gonna do a mask, face mask. I've been absolutely loving the face masks of Dr. Jart. They're pretty good and they're also highly rated. Ooh. You have to peel off some kind of protection. All good. I think I'm gonna have to use like scissors. Oh my god, I look ridiculous. I look like I'm gonna go rub a bed. I, s I saw this on a, like a, a video, I just like cut it here, here, down the middle, so I can like stick it better to my skin and, and all. And then we do the other side, like so. Mm, there we go, this looks actually not so bad. <laughs> Ta-da! This will probably have to sit for also about 10 minutes. My timer ran off, but I'm still doing my little TikTok. Let's do it again. Okay, let's take off the face mask and hop into the shower. Oof. I just got out of the shower and I feel fresh. I did all my hair care stuff and I'm excited for the result to see if it's really soft or not and how it looks oh my god my hair is so soft right now I'm just gonna finish up with some hair oil I've been using Elsef oil this one it makeup is done something simple everyday look like always You know what for me is the ultimate self-care? Shopping! <laughs> Today the stores in Antwerp were open because it's the first Sunday of the month. So we went to the Vogelsmarkt and then we went a little bit shopping. I'll show you guys what I got. Let's do a little clothing haul. I just... Here's a little sneak peek of all the things I got. I got like four different kinds of pants, or is it three? Nope, it's four. And then some sweater and a top and then more tops and then some skirts and a cute, cute bag. I will show you in a minute. Okay, so first of all, we're gonna start off with some clothes from NAKD. I didn't buy so many of it, but you see, I bought these pants really smooth pants with a little slit and I am obsessed with this sweater. I've worn it already a couple of times. It has this cute detail in the back as you can see which is so so gorgeous. 
The other thing I got from NAKD is this knitted sweater dress, which is so warm. And usually I put on some panties and then I put on my cowboy boots or just my regular boots and then just like a coat and this is, you know, it's really easy and still stylish and casual again and so warm and the turtleneck is like so thick so this one is also a great find however I am thinking of like shortening it a bit maybe you can, you can I've tried to put on a belt but it doesn't really look that good so I was thinking of like alter it like to this I like the vibe of it. Moving on to Subdued. I... Oh my god. I mean this sweater. Yes, as you can see. The most gorgeous sweater. And absolutely comfortable pants. I mean, in Subdued, I didn't know. I was like going... Looking for the size of my pants. And normally I have a 36. And so I took the 36 size in, from these pants and I couldn't even get them up here. I don't know how petite the women are or for who they make them, but this is size 42, if you believe me. And I mean, my hips are kind of wide, like curvy. I didn't know I had that big of a size in the subdued pants, but anyways, totally worth it. These pants are absolutely gorgeous and so comfy and just free. It's kind of between, it's like more of a low waist pants. And then this sweater, the off shoulder sweater is so, oh my god, I just, I'm in love. I'm really, I'm in love. This is, and you can put it down as low as you want. So, or just put it all the way up and just leave it a little bit like this, like a boat neck and it's the same in the back and this is like absolutely the best sweater I have ever owned just like that that's how much credit I'm giving this sweater I also got this amazing like the material of this top is like heaven it's just like a short Top. And I also got this kind of top in red, but my friend borrowed it, so it's still at her place. So I can't show it to you guys, but the the red top is gorgeous. It's like the back is like all cut out and so beautiful. And then lastly, I got this cute sweater, which was on sale. These pants I already have, it's from Levi's. And so cute and soft. This is what I wear it on. And some beige jeans. And then moving on to Zara. I am obsessed with this outfit. This is whoop, the look. And I mean the detail, like with these, the straps, and then with the skirt here. It's not a skirt, it's actually a skirt, like a short but also a skirt. And I found the cutest matching bag. I mean, wow. This is so cute. And it comes with like a little wallet. There's a strap, so you can wear it, wear it like this. Or with the strap, so cool. And then there's another strap if you don't want this. You can use this strap if you want. Then I got this top, like a brown top like the same material as my one from Subdue which is really comfy and these pants oh my god they're so good I mean come on and I also got like a brown top Sara here and oh my god this is so good I am literally obsessed with collection right now I just I walked to the store and I just found the stuff you know it was so so good and lastly, I got another set of pants and this cute cup. All like brown colors, which I really like for winter. And it's so cute and just like ankle length. And then moving on to mango, I got this top. It's more for going out. It's like see-through and the bra came with it, but I'm absolutely 
obsessed with it. It's, so, it's lace and it's so sexy. You can put on a skirt or some pants and this one is absolutely gorgeous. And you can actually you can attach the bra onto the top. I didn't do it now, but this is And then also from Mango, I got this cute little denim skirt. And then lastly, also from Mango, I got this skirt. This top is from NAKD. I got it a while back. And I love black when I go partying. I'm all for colors and stuff, but when you go party, it's like stylish. The top is gorgeous. This, you can, it's like strap so you can untie it and then you can like wear it different but most of the time I wear it like this which I absolutely love and then there's this little I just I'm obsessed with this